a standing ovation for a Ukrainian veteran of the Second World War. Who fought the Ukrainian independence against the Russians and continues to support the troops today, even at his age of 98. Invited by House Speaker Anthony Rhoda to witness Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky's address to Parliament, Yaroslav Humka is one of his constituents. He's a Ukrainian hero, a Canadian hero, and we thank him for all his service. That was the jubilant scene Friday. Now new details have emerged about that war service MPs applauded. Humka served in the 1st Galician Division, a voluntary unit commanded by the Nazis. The unit is complicit in the Holocaust. They this Jewish human rights campaigner says there's no defending former soldiers like Hunka. You swore allegiance to Hitler and you were involved with the massacre of civilians. So it doesn't matter if you uh, try and claim that you were defending against communism, you were still involved with the Nazi war machine. The division's history is murky. It's volunteers united by a desire to take on the Soviet Union, well, says this academic. For them, the um, ultimate evil was Moscow occupation. Rhoda has now apologized and says he regrets ever inviting him. I recognize an individual in the gallery. I have subsequently become aware of more information which causes me to regret my decision to do so, he says in a statement. I accept full responsibility for my actions. Still, the opposition is asking how this could happen. The Prime Minister's office says it wasn't aware the Speaker had invited Hunka, saying in a statement, no advance notice was provided to the Prime Minister's office, nor the Ukrainian delegation, about the invitation or the recognition. And JP, you've been trying to reach Yaroslav Hunka. Yeah, Ian, we've asked Yaroslav Hunka and his family to comment. There's been no response. He's defended, though, his war service in the past, calling it a fight for Ukrainian independence. Regardless, Russian propagandists have already pounced, using his presence in Parliament to malign Ukraine and Canada's support for their war effort. Ian? J.P. Tasker in Ottawa. Thanks.